It's the time of year when everyone apparently goes a little pumpkin crazy. Almost everyone. Um, well, that's right. You're not a huge pumpkin fan. No. Secrets out. Well, the roots of the obsession go back deep into our culture. WFMZ business reporter Tim Silvies went searching around for answers about the mighty pumpkin. Pumpkin beer, pumpkin desserts, and of course, pumpkin latte. I love this time of year. I love pumpkin spice latte. Pumpkins are everywhere. Why do people love pumpkins so much? Well, it's a good question. Years ago, Cindy Ott was helping a friend sell pumpkins at a farm stand. As customers poured in, she wanted to know, why are people buying this vegetable they're not even going to eat? Trying to answer that question, she ended up with a book. Pumpkin. Most people around the world don't like pumpkins, and so we like it because of the values that attach to it. According to Ott, it's not just the taste. She says pumpkins make people feel a deep connection to the past when agriculture was king. It's supporting a way of life that I think that we all feel is a valuable way of life. And while rare, one that still exists. For a lot of people, pumpkins are their livelihood. This family farm has been here since the 1800s. They grow all kinds of things, but 75% of their revenue comes from pumpkins. It's our biggest crop. Bob Lang and his sister own Willisbrook Farm, where people pick their own pumpkins. My grandmother was born and raised here. My mom and her two sisters were born and raised here. My two sisters and myself born and raised here. And I have a niece and a nephew that were born and raised here. He sees that nostalgia in his customers' eyes. It's kind of like a throwback to being able to go out, take a hay ride, go out in unspoiled country and enjoy the scenery, pick a pumpkin, and just feel like, you know, you're getting your back to your roots. Do you love pumpkins? Uh, yes, because <laughs> they're making me an income that I can, you know, sub uh, live off of. Tim Sophie's 69 News.